Bob Benavania had never invented anything in his life until he had to wear a cast for a stress fracture in his ankle. He sent me home with crutches, which, which, which seemed fine at first until I got home and I realized that I, I was going to have no relationship with these crutches. They were going to have to go. So after getting his doctors okay, the retired firefighter scrapped his crutches and built an alternative. Here's the original monster. Using a headrest from a piece of exercise equipment, four furniture sliders, two bungee cords, and a belt from a vacuum cleaner, he created a device he could attach to his cast and walk on. I got around pretty well with that for the next six weeks, and when he re-MRI'd me, the, the, uh, the fracture had healed. Now that original monster has been streamlined into what Bob calls the cascade minus the wheels. The reason I use the word cascade is because the, way, the simple way that it's, it's attached. The rubber straps, padding, and adjustable insert stabilizes the foot, absorbs impact, and distributes the patient's weight evenly. I like the idea of um, more independence for the uh, individual and the ability to be more mobile. Physical therapist Sharon Baum says more mobility can be good for healing. It could also help diabetics with foot wounds or patients with osteoporosis and weak bones. You get a little bit of that weight bearing, which then will help with bone density. Bob has a patent for the cascade. Now he hopes his initial frustration will turn into a marketing sensation.